Today you will understand about a new surgical treatment for chronic sinus disease. Sinusitis is the inflammation of the paranasal sinuses due to infection. The paranasal sinuses are hollow air spaces in the human skull surrounding the nose. They include the frontal sinuses over the eyes, maxillary sinuses inside each cheekbone, ethmoid sinuses just behind the bridge of the nose and sphenoid sinuses behind the ethmoids in the upper region of the nose. Their walls are lined with mucus secreting membranes, and in fact, we call it a mucous membrane. There are small hairs within the lining of the mucous membrane that sweep the mucus out of the sinuses so it can drain out through your nose and even sometimes down the back of our throat. These mucous membranes can become infected, and when they do, those mucous membranes get thickened and swollen and inflamed, and they can block the natural openings into the sinus passageways that prevent fluid from draining out. Sinus Surgery Severe sinusitis may require surgical opening of the passageways if all medical treatments fail. And traditionally, this has been done with rigid steel instruments, removing tissue to create openings within the sinuses to help fluid drain. And oftentimes, this involves removal of tissue and even removal of bone. However, recently, new, less invasive technology called balloon sinoplasty has been introduced to treat patients in a less invasive manner. Using this technology, a balloon catheter is delivered up into the blocked passageways, and that catheter is then expanded gently to open the natural openings of the sinuses. This is less traumatic to the tissues around the sinuses but is equally effective at draining the sinuses and providing pressure relief and pain relief.